All right, what's up folks? It's me Barky and I'm back with another RimWorld showcase mod and that is the hot coffee mod, which is something that I've been looking at for the past few days and I've kind of wanted to do it for a little while. So that's pretty cool. Pretty much this is a mod that makes coffee something in the game. Uh, it adds two things, two production methods called the electric coffee machine and the electric decaffeination machine, as well as adding a growing thing for uh, raw beans. So I can go ahead, coffee plant, min skill five, so you need the skill of five to do it. Just pretty cool, you can see Reverick hidden up over here. They grow pretty quickly actually, I think. Okay, they'll be fine. Yeah, so we've got raw coffee over here. And then four research things. So you need to go ahead and research buzz coffee. Let's just finish that. Sweet decaf coffee. Where's the other ones? Somewhere around here. There's four of them. <laughs> uh, I think. Nope, that's just brewing. Okay, anyways. Just pretty cool. You need crafting. So let me go ahead and open this door and just add in some coffee beans so I can show you guys what it is. Cook coffee beans. Okay, cool. No refrigerator spoils in one season. So it's good to keep it in the fridge if you can. And add bill. We can make some simple coffee. That takes 25 cooked coffee beans. So let's make it until we have 15. Buzz coffee. And this takes 25 psychedelic coffee beans. I'll get to that just now. Add 15. Sweet decaf coffee. And that's 50 decaf coffee beans. Which is what happens when you take the decaffeination uh, station and you take raw coffee beans which you get from this and put it through the decaffeination station. So let's go ahead and set that to 150 and I'll go ahead and spawn some more coffee beans in the raw ones because I don't really want to wait for this to grow and finish. So yeah, raw coffee beans, there we go. Alright, so you can see straight away they go and do it. Reverick just made himself some coffee, that's simple coffee and that's decaf coffee beans. So I can go ahead and so now you can see that, oops, wrong one. The decaf coffee can be made, which is pretty cool. They get made in stacks of five, as far as I can tell. Which is pretty awesome, actually. Let's go ahead and we can get the, uh, the effects of the coffee. So if I go to assign, no drugs at the moment. Coffee is a drug in the game. And luckily, every bit of coffee you can customize, which is really nice. So all four of the ones that they add. So I'm going to go ahead and say simple coffee. Well, actually, I'm not going to allow him to do it. I'm just going to tell him to. Where did they take it? Did they drink it already? No. Oh, right, right. It's outside. Okay. So it's obviously not included in the foods over here. Might be items. Manufactured. Drugs. Is it included in drugs? Yes, it is. Okay. So it's included in drugs. It's, it's, I think this is the only drug you need to. Uh, actually try out. Okay, so. I, I mean, not try out, sorry. I think this is the only drug you need to refrigerate. That's pretty crazy. Alright, so Baki is gonna go drink it. We can see the effects. Coffeed up, which gives you plus 10% consciousness, 10% of moving, 10% manipulation, and tiredness up 90%. Or down, I think. My bad. Yeah. So that's pretty cool. It's, it's pretty much a buzz. Uh, Finish sweet D. Oh, sweet. Thanks. Thanks. Okay, old puck is angry. But yeah, that's pretty cool. Uh, the nice thing is you can actually grow it yourself, and it's the mod maker himself calls it a weakened, a weakened wake up. Which, if you know wake up, it's another kind of drug. This is really irritating. Okay, good job, Brett. But yeah, it's really nice that they give you the option to change which coffee you can take. That is really awesome. So let's go ahead and spawn some uh, psychedelic coffee beans. These are really awesome. Coffee beans are cooked with psychoid leaves. They are bursting with caffeine and contain powerful psychite agents. So the problem with all coffee is that you can get addicted to it. And just that's kind of like drugs in real It's kind of like coffee in real life in that you can't actually get addicted to it. Uh, so that's weird, I guess. I think it's buzz coffee. Yeah, okay, so they can make buzz coffee now. Put that up there. Put the 20. Brewing buzz coffee. Okay, we're gonna try out the buzz coffee now. I think it's that one. Let's see what this does. 
caffeine rush. And remember, this is made of the same stuff that they put into, like, f the cocaine in this game. Uh, consciousness, 20%. Moving, 20%. Manipulation, 20%. Tiredness, 85 Global work speed, plus 10%. So it's really freaking good. It's really good and easy to make, because it's all made with growing. You don't need any outside... You don't need any traders to come and give you stuff. The only prerequisite that you have is that you need a level 5 to grow it, which is something that... Any grower with a passion, I think, will have more than level 5. So that's really simple, otherwise you just kind of spam potatoes until you get level 5. It's, it's simple. It's easy. So that's really awesome. I wonder if the animals can take it. <laughs> oh, that would be kind of crazy. So you can keep researching it as the game progresses, starting with simple coffee, moving up to the sweeter one, I think. And then the two machines, you get the decaffeination station and the coffee machine. And that's it. That's all there is. And you get a nice cheap drug, which I think is kind of broken. I don't think it should be added to the game. Unless maybe they made like a weaker version of the mod or something. One that doesn't... Because right now this is just a buff. Like your tiredness is a bit up afterwards, I think. I think it affects your tiredness afterwards. But besides that, it's just a straight up buff. And I don't think that's good. Unless maybe they added a buff that if you drank it at a decent temperature or, or something like that, like added another way around it. Because if you're going to buff something, you need to nerf another aspect. You don't need to nerf the coffee, for example. You could nerf something else, but that's pretty cool. And the machines only take one block each, which is just amazing. Because obviously, obviously, <laughs> every, every production table takes like two, 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 so... It's nice, I just made this little room just in case I needed more space, which I realized I didn't. So, yeah. Anyways, guys, hope you have a fantastic day. I love this mod, I think you should definitely try it out. I'll put the link in the description. I usually do a lot of mods by the maker of this mod called Dingo. He makes some really great stuff. So if you recognize his name, go ahead and, and give him a check out because it's really cool. This is some really intu intuitive stuff. Damn it, I'm a retard. Anyways, hope you have a fantastic day. Bye-bye, everyone.